Pay me no mind. Pick up the pace. All right, I will. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. So about Labyrinth Grove here. This is a rather peculiar place here because, well, look, look at this. Look at this if I take the top route. Huh. It looks like we're back to the start, doesn't it? Oh, oh. Yes, we did. Well, no, not exactly. Well, yeah, I'm sure I could figure out my way through here. So basically, this is like a sort of kind of trial and error thing. As I don't believe there are any sort of indicators as to where you're actually supposed to go. And I don't remember what the exact route is. It was not that. <laughs> so I guess it's up, up, and then probably down. Oh, wait, wait, it was... Whoops, um, oops, oop, whoop, whoops. <laughs> it is incorrect. There you go. So it's down, then up. Maybe up again? I don't remember. I don't remember. I just know it's a trial and error type thing. Uh, mm, I didn't mean to do that. Eh, I just wanted to see if there are any Pokemon on the upper row before I go to the lower routes. Uh, okay. <laughs> Moving on with the groove on, don't attack. Ah! <laughs> I said don't attack. You didn't listen to me at all, did you? Did you? Eh. Well, that's what you get. That's what you get. So yeah, I'm trying the lower one here. Okay, yeah, that was it. So. There's a Murkrow. Yes, a Murkrow again. Is it the same Murkrow? Probably. Probably. Well, it's in the tree now. <laughs> I guess it does. Kind of? Maybe? I'm not sure. This haze is kind of weird. Didn't they say something about the Pokedex about Murkrow's mysteriousness and how they can lead people astray? Well, yeah, that's exactly what happens in the forest, actually. Yeah, in other games, if you know Murkrow's backstory, it's it's something that it, 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 it leads people and other things astray, and yeah... Uh, I don't think I needed one of these, so release it goes. But anyway, uh, so yeah, that was the whole thing, is that the Murkrow kind of made us get lost. And uh, just out of curiosity, what if I were to go down here before I do... Uh, yeah, I didn't think that would work. <laughs> so we gotta do something about that Murkrow. Yes. Yes. And back in it goes. So it is absolutely doing something. Makes me wonder if Gordor, uh, Gordor ticked it off enough and that's why it's doing it to us. <laughs> Alright, let's do something about the Murkrow because we actually can't progress unless we do something about said Murkrow. And we got a Pampy. There's a tree. You know what to do. <laughs> and that's why there's Pampy here. So yeah. Just gonna knock it out of the tree, and there we go. Let's give it a good old-fashioned capture. Well, it kind of does. Here we go. Let's capture it, because you enraged it. <laughs> Bring it on, little one. Oh, no. Yeah, this is a troublesome battle. Five Pokemon at once. It's a boss. It doesn't seem like a boss, because they're all little weak Pokemon, but... They all work together in unison pretty well. They all got these projectile poop, and Murkrow can black out the area and make it hard to see. It's teamwork of doom. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, come on now. Uh, uh, oh, he's gonna black out the area, make it hard to see. Oh no, it's not that hard to see, actually. Uh, 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 mm. Okay, this looks like a good opportunity. Uh, that was a good opportunity. Ah, I got hit by the haze. <laughs> there we go. Got that one. And now, and now, and now, got that one. We're getting them down. We're narrowing it down. And, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, that's one short. One short. Oh, no, don't you dare haze. Ah, because it's going to cover up the spinner rack. I'm trying to get the, I guess you could say, henchmen down first, because... Mercury will, re will require the most circles. Uh, come on, get in the right position, dang it. I could stun Mercury with a circle. And then go after this one. Yeah, there we go, that's a good strategy. 
So, but yeah, as you can tell, Murkrow requires quite a few circles. As a matter of fact, I think I'm gonna discharge just to speed this along a little bit here. And hopefully I won't flub this up, because every time I use a Poke Assist, for some reason I mess it up. <laughs> I didn't this time. <laughs> but yeah, Murkrow moves pretty haphazardly, so it's pretty difficult to capture. Especially with how many times you need to circle it. So yeah, there's the backstory on the Murkrow. Enter its forest and you will be lost. Especially if you mock it. <laughs> it's it's alright, all is well now. We're free from the grasp of the forest. Alright, 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 relax, relax. Okay, fine! <laughs> and this pops us out right here. What? Um... Uh, 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 okay. <laughs> yeah, they are, definitely. <laughs> I think you've you've built such a reputation yourself <laughs> so far. But uh, uh, you, I, I never said anything, never mind. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, uh, don't, don't you dare, I made it through. And how do we manage to pass through this wall anyway? That's kind of, kind of silly here. But whatever, whatever. I should say wall of foliage. Indeed I was! You did? You sh <laughs> sure didn't seem like it, did it? Ha ha ha. Foo 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 to you too. Mission clear! Woo! And you may go on your way, Sir Gordor. Ooh, uh, uh. So rude, that guy. But whatever, whatever. Wait, Murph came into the forest? How did he make it here? Ah, eh, whatever. <laughs> I guess he is more capable of a ranger than we thought. Awesome. Yeah, sure. Uh, what? No, I said, I said yes. I didn't say no. Uh, really? Ooh, what was it? Oh, Aria. Oh, she's awful. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, you could tell me on the way back, I guess. Uh, not right now. <laughs> Let's hear some more dialogue, yeah! Yeah, he was, and ornery. <laughs> eh, he's alright though. That all worked out well. Thank you, thank you. Heck yeah, Ranger Ranger! Because we solved all the puzzles of the forest! Woo. Well, we'll go back in there later to, you know, get more Pokemon by cutting stuff and breaking stuff. Because <laughs> you see, we, there's a bunch of things along the way that we couldn't do. But that is okay, we'll be able to do them eventually. We now have the power of Dark and Ghost Poke Assists. And, and, and... Six friend Pokémon now, we don't have to reorganize our party nearly as much! Yeah! I'm so happy! Please uncap the seven soon, I'm tired of having to release those poor things. <laughs> So, forcing and partner gauge as well, so we got an even more powerful discharge. Well, providing you charge it up all the way to the max, but you can use it even at its lowest point, so... Yep, you may take advantage of that too, whatever way you feel like using it. Who knows? It sounded like he was looking for something legendary. So maybe he's a special rare Pokémon collector or something like that. You're welcome! Eh, yeah, sure, why not? Ooh... That does sound great, so let's head over to Summerland. That's kind of a trek. Is there any way that we could get there faster? Op good opportunity for what? <gasps> we can finally use the Dragon on Bus! After all that teasing! So much teasing! So much teasing! <laughs> Alright, let's Dragonite Bus it up! Um, uh, man, you guys still don't have any different dialogue? Man, man, man. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Dragonite bus time, let's ride. Thank you, thank you. Yep, yep. Alright, hey, but he's teasing again. Really now? <sighs> oh, how do we, yeah. Alright, I can do that. I can capture that grumbly Dragonite with no problem. I do not, because, well, I didn't write him, that was off camera. <laughs> ah. Yes, that is true. I agree. 
I agree with that too! And now, let's do it! It's Dragonite time! Not yet, I want to hear your dialogue. <laughs> Just out of curiosity. Mm, yeah, probably. Hopefully, might be, maybe, who knows? It's a pretty tricky one to capture as it's pretty quick, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, no, maybe Dragonite has something else to say. Hold on! It does not. <laughs> I'm ready! <laughs> Let's do it! I'm putting everything I've got into this. Let's do it, Dragonite! Capture time! Woo! So yeah, let's look how speedy that thing is, and it's big, it shoots tornadoes everywhere, and it does a lot of damage, and it's just trouble all left and right. Oh, land please. Just land in a nice, nice spot, thank you. <laughs> just gotta pick the right opportunity and then you can get it. You don't need a discharge or anything like that to get it, you just need to have the right opportunity. Woo! Victory! Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I only really had a couple of attempts, but quite a show, I guess it was. <laughs> and, what well, really? Interesting. Well, he was my teacher, I guess, in the long tutorials at the start of the walkthrough. But whatever, whatever. It does, it does, and it's happy. I can finally hug it. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. All right, I shall. Uh, yeah, he does. Yeah, I... Alright, let's do it! To Summerland we go! I will hug on to you and we will be... Well, that isn't what I was expecting, but it worked out. It worked out. <laughs> yeah, actually, I, it was exactly what I was expecting. I find that animation pretty funny, though. Alright. And there they go. And here he comes. That was a really quick fetching. <laughs> thank you, thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome. <laughs> Alright, let's go! Um... Uh, oh no. Uh... I might want it. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows what it might be? Uh, it looks pretty... something. Is it a bowl? Is it a pot? Is it a kettle? Is uh question mark? Yeah, that would be pretty nice. Yeah, this is the mechanic that we've seen in that other house um, west of here. Mm -hmm. Interesting. I wonder if I could use something like that in the future. The aqua mole. Well. Is there any chance of being able to repair that? Ooh, that actually sounds like a pretty good gift. I agree with Cameron here. <laughs> Maybe there's some underwater Pokemon I could catch. Bolster my browser. Who knows? <laughs> hmm. What I do know is it's currently junk, <laughs> so he can't do anything with it. Yeah, I yeah, sorta, kinda. Mm. Uh, we, I was kind of already there, but uh, details. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Jungle relic, a legend. Ooh, ooh, four challenges. I would like to tackle those challenges. Oh, okay. I'll I'll tackle three out of four. That'll work. <laughs> Oh, yeah, definitely don't clear the force challenge ever. <laughs> uh, well, really? <laughs> Isn't it sort of kind of dangerous to do the capture challenge, which you sort of did to quote unquote improve your skills and keep sharp and ah, oh, forget about it. <laughs> yeah, that does sound pretty fun. Heck yeah! I love challenges. It'd be a nice little break from the missions we've been doing. Uh, so, okay. Raised hill, deep in the jungle. Yeah, I was I was there. Yeah, I remember. Hidden... Oh! So there's something beyond said statue. Interesting. Very, very interesting, I must say. <laughs> uh. So it looks like everyone is a very, very laid-back ranger around these parts. 
Hmm. Hmm. Eh, well, you're just kind of repeating yourself. Eh, no problem. That's easy enough. Alright. Uh, anything else? No, no? Okay. Now, on our trek back, I don't remember if there's new Pokemon or dialogue or stuff and stuff to find along the way. Uh... <laughs> Uh, there might actually be new dialogue in the city, so maybe we should take a, a peek see around this place. Uh, is it from... Is it... No, it couldn't be him. Lunik. <laughs> I don't know who she's talking about. Hmm. 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 I don't know. I don't know. I prefer to kick back with a gamer 10. <laughs> hmm. No, no. Ooh, hmm. Interesting. I wonder if you'll be able to see those someday. Maybe. Maybe. Who knows? Only I know, or people who have played this game before. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, that must be. <laughs> Never mind. I shouldn't name names. Because uh, you might take insult to calling it junk. Yes. <laughs> Um, 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 wait, did I, did I go back in these two? I don't think I did, uh, I did not, so they do have cute tails, though. Uh, yes, 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 go, go, go! Yeah, I shouldn't have skipped these buildings on my way back through. I do not! In fact, I don't have DS hardware on an emulator, so I can't even check that. <laughs> and moving on with the groove on. Uh, I suppose I could check the PC clock. It was, uh, it's currently 4.03 a.m. Central Time. Yes, yes, I've been recording a bunch of parts in a row. Because it takes a while to edit these things, so it makes makes sense to have a bunch of extra time to be able to do- Ah, what the heck is a slowdown? To be able to do some editing, but anyway. Alright, we are done here. Let's go back through the junk- Oh, oh no, not done. <laughs> There's still more peeps to check. Um, maybe you could come up with me, we could check it out. Yeah, I'm not gonna clear all of those challenges, because I heard something else. It's kinda bad if you clear all four challenges. Let's just say that, yes. <laughs> so anyway. Um, okay, um, nah. Uh, just asking for a massage from a complete stranger, not at the chiropractic office. Seems legit. Did I get one Trico before? I think I did. Yes, yes, yes. So up we go to the jungle relic. Heck yeah! Um, 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 oh, 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 don't you dare. No, you don't. I'm just checking around to see if there's anything new around here. Because there might be, and also you might have forgotten where we need to go. Who knows? Who? Oh, huh? I. Uh, wait, there's not? Uh, is there still a Snorlax? What the? Uh, yeah, I suppose. Every day, I saw everything's okay about the Snorlax. Hey, wait, wait, where are you, where are you two going? Hey, come back here. No, uh, what the? Oh no, don't do that. Not the Snorlax, anything but the Snorlax. It's cuddly. It would make the ultimate beanbag chair. Stop it, stop it. No, bad. Bad Pokemon. And I don't think Snorlax noticed at all, really. <laughs> I don't think they heard it at all. Its tummy is just too fluffy. Mm. Oh. Yes. It <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh no. Major fights between partners. Oh no. This is not good. It looks like we have been broken up. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> they understood English somehow. They understood the feelings, maybe that's how they did it. Yeah, that's probably what it was. Mm -hmm. True. Very true. Yep. Alright. All is well once again! Oh yeah! Now that sounds better. Don't attack random sleeping Pokemon. They're just being there nice and peaceful like. 
And boy, Snorlaxes do have a knack for uh, sleeping in the mis most inopportune places. And did that? Did I just get attacked in a cutscene again? Well, I should say in a dialogue screen again. I did. So, so cheap. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, 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 okay. I don't remember if there's a save point next to that relic or, uh, or not, but I guess we're gonna see. <laughs> I'm managing to dodge them quite well, though. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot that I checked that sign before. All you need to do is climb up. Whoa, whoa, the vines aren't there. The vines are on to the right, where this path is, of course. But yeah, I don't know if there's a save point by the relic, so I'm tempted to just save here and end off the parts. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I begin to do the challenges of the relic. Are you excited? You better be, because the challenges are pretty dang fun.